If you're still plotting your drawings and title blocks directly from the model space in AutoCAD, you need to stop immediately. There's a much better way that is more efficient, more accurate, and easier to set up. In today's video, we're going to be diving into viewports in AutoCAD, including how to use them, how to set them up, tips, tricks, and common mistakes to avoid. And if you stick around to the end, I'm going to share a couple bonuses that are going to save you a ton of time, guaranteed. Let's jump right into today's video. So first things first, you don't want to be creating your title blocks within model space. This can create scaling and replication issues as well as you're going to lose your geo referencing if you have to create more than one uh, drawing or sheet since you're moving things around. This is particularly important for things like site and floor plans in civil, but it's also just best practice to be using these layout tabs down below. So if we jump over to one of these layouts down below, we're going to set up and create some viewports. And I'm going to show you these steps to create your own, as well as a bunch of tips and tricks along the way. So I've deleted the existing viewport here, and you can see I've just got a simple blank title block. You can get these title blocks from my website, cadintentions.com, and I'll put links down below to my courses where we create and show how to set these up from scratch. But moving along, you're going to want to type in MV. That is the shortest and easiest way to create a model view uh, or a viewport. Now it's going to, by default, ask you to select a corner of your viewport. I'm just going to click the top left corner and the bottom right. Clicking inside of the new viewport activates it and lets me move around within the model space. You can think of layout and model space as two separate entities. The layout space and viewport is like a window looking into your model space. Your model space is a real world sized object that can have all of your designs, your drawing, all of the objects are within the model space and this window or viewport that is in your layout can be moved around, zoomed in and out. It's just like you're looking through a window into your model space. So when it's activated, you're moving around your model space. And when you double click outside of your viewport, you're moving around your layout. This is a great thing to get used to and understand in AutoCAD.